Hello, uh, my name is Lamin. Um, um, in this tutorial, we're just gonna look um, in the drop down box. Um, so, I've already been ahead, I've already created um, um, a file called dropbox.html. So, we first start putting our HTML. Okay, with that, we close our HTML. Okay, so here, put our head, sorry, we put our head. We close our head. Okay. So here, put our body. We close our body. In this topic, it's really going to be very interesting. You will love this because it's actually going to introduce something called the form. So what the form does is the form is used to create many stuff. It can be used to create it. Um, um, it can be used to create um, what you called um, an input box. It can be used to create a drop down box. It can be used to create a submit button. So it's really cool. So if we call this a drop down box, so we slash title. Okay. So here we come here, we say let's introduce the word form. Okay, let's introduce the form. Form some some just close it there, form that way. But what I'll do is I will say form action, I'll put an action, and I say that and I close it. So we go down, let's stop forget that, let's flow, let's close our form, we close our form. Then in the form what do we need? We need a select. Okay? Meaning what select we need to tell them what you need to select and what is going to be the title and names of what you're going to select. Okay, what you're going to select is we're just going to open something and we call it select. Okay, uh, we're going to call it select. Sorry, I'm spelling wrong. Okay, select, and uh, we call the name um, as charity. Okay, charity. It's not even spelled that way, but we just gonna get it from here. We're not in a spelling competition, so um, so first, what I always do, as I always do, let's go close our select. So we close our select. So we close our select. So in the select, what do we need? We need options. So Still so giving you lots of options, so that means for it to output it as a drop down box. So, these op options we're gonna say options, options, okay. So, option, and we need to give it a value. And in the value, we need to give it a value. What will the value be? Let's say car, let's use a car, let's say Volvo, okay. We say Volvo, we close the Volvo, and uh, this is the most interesting part. What do we need in it? We need to put the charity. We, need, we don't need to forget about the charity because the charity, what we're telling here, even that we need you to put this Volvo in the charity. So we need to, like, take that, copy that, we need to paste it here, okay, and then close this. And then close the option. We close the option. So, in this case, we just we don't need to do the same step as it. Just check this way how we do it in this way. If we do that, if we do that, we say value. Uh, we say uh, uh, we say sub. We say sub, and we close that. And what do we want to call it? Let's call it text. I don't know, let's call it text. Text one, yeah, let's call it text one. We close our option. It's just something basic. You will actually like this. If we come here, okay, let's just copy that. Let's just copy that to be much more faster. Uh, paste that, paste that. And uh, we can just say that's one, sorry. That's two, that's three, and uh, if we change that to maybe Fiat, because I like Italian stuff, so we call Fiat, 
we call oh yeah Odi let's not forget Odi uh, we call Odi and uh, you know we can add more as we want you know um, if I copy that paste that we call this four we call this five we call this six so we're gonna have six drum dot drum box so here we can call it BMW BMW here we can call it bench okay here we can call it golf something like that so um, in this case I think we've probably done everything so I'll just before I we play it I'll like to summarize it a bit we first open our HTML we have our um, head we put our title in the head we have our body in our body we have an action we have just introduced an action um, the form that's an action but this action actually is not doing anything because it's blank so we have our select and our select name will be charity and we have options that the drop down boxes and they will be the values we have Volvo we have, um, we have Saab I don't know if Saab is a car but anyway I just put it there we have Fjord, we have Audi, we have BMW, we have Benz and we have Golf and we then close, we then close our, um, our select and um, we close our mm -hmm. form and then we close our body and we close our HTML so we have not closed the HTML actually I did close that okay so we close our HTML and likely if we run that it should give us something cool let's run it okay it's 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 coming up um, my computer is a bit slow today um, let's give it some time oh yeah um, sorry I need to run it with Google Chrome um, let's run it with Google Chrome okay now it's it's running let's give it a few seconds while it's loading and taking time to load okay if you guys can see this I can see it wow we got everything that we need that's the way of creating a drop down box if you don't know we got our charity do you remember the charity it's here do you remember the charity yeah you do if, it, if we want to change some stuff let's say you wanna call that let's call it sub let's also call it sub so let's call it sub sorry I'm a bit crazy here my spellings I need to go back to primary schools uh, we call that third Okay, and we call that call that Audi. Okay, we call that BMW. And then here we call it Benz. Okay, here we call it Golf. Okay, just check it out. What will you do? What do you think it will do? Guess before I play. What do you think it will actually do? I think it'll just change the names. What do you think? Interesting. Let's check it out. Wow, it changed everything. Look at it. I think that's it. If you were having problems of building or creating a drop down box in HTML, that's actually the right thing of doing it. And uh, in further, I'll, I'll create, I'll make um, another tutorial which I'll introduce the PHP which will be embedded into this and you will see how. How lovely it is. Actually it's everything here. And then, yeah, um see you see you in the next tutorial and uh, please like, subscribe and uh, don't forget to always check on me. Email me when you need me. Thank you.